Boris Johnson has been reassured the UK would face no long-lasting effects should the British government proceed to snub part of the deal struck with the European Union. The UK would face no long-lasting damage to its reputations should Boris Johnson choose to ignore aspects of the political declaration he signed up to with the Europan Union. Through the Brexit negotiations, the UK and the EU emerged as having a vastly differing view on the prominence of the declaration, with the British government long reiterating the non-legally binding nature of the document. Professor Alan Winters, the director of the UK Trade Policy Observatory at the University of Sussex, told Express.co.uk, the political declaration is non-binding legally. It was believed to have been signed in good faith. I think it was signed in good faith. I think what's happened, in a sense, is things have changed a little bit within the British government. If Britain did not go along with what's in the political declaration, if it was a wholesale denial of it, that would do some damage to Britain's reputation. But I think the British government would put in a lot of diplomatic efforts to say it's a one-off, it's very special. He added, so I don't think the damage to reputation would be particularly long-lasting as long as we then got back to sensible and considered positions that didn't get reversed. The comments from Professor Winters came shortly before the government announced it would table a series of changes to the internal market bill that would affect the withdrawal agreement struck with Brussels. The proposed amendments have caused further complicated talks with the EU, whose officials had already warned against any attempts to change the political declaration. With both aspects of the withdrawal agreement now under threat, Boris Johnson has been warned changes of a no deal have increases as the bloc warned the Northern Ireland protocol affected by the changes is paramount to securing a trade deal. At the end of the eighth round of talks in London, EU chief negotiator Michel Barnier warned the union is prepared to launch legal action against the UK for breach of contract.